Uh, it's it's weird. Like a lot of people always wonder what they would do with extra time, and a lot of people have extra time on their hands. It's interesting to see. Like my wife, for instance, she took up knitting for a second. She wanted to do that as an escape. She thought it'd be relaxing, uh, but it was anything but. Uh, <laughs> it, she did it for three days, and it was a dark three days. <laughs> we do not like to revisit that. She is very gifted at a lot of things, but knitting is not one of them. Everyone, I would know she was knitting because from another room I would just hear fuck. And then she would vent to me, knitting fucking sucks. And then it would drive her to drinking, and then that didn't help her knitting. It was a vicious cycle. I don't miss it. <laughs> Meanwhile, uh, one hobby I have taken up is uh, late night high and or drunken shopping online. Um, I know a lot of people are doing this. A lot of us are filling voids. If we can't go do something we love, then we're going to buy something baffling. Uh, the decisions I've made are ridiculous. One day in the mail, I got a bottle of smelling salts and a bow and arrow. What? 